Your adventure to the Royal BC Museum will begin when you arrive through the group entrance doors by Thunderbird Park. Someone may greet you and give you a short introduction to what you may see and do. Your teacher or group leader will get your tickets and a staff member will advise you about where to put your coats and bags. If you're staying for lunch, you may use one of our designated areas or even enjoy your lunch on our beautiful grounds. Remember, there are no food or drinks allowed in the exhibitions, so before you go up, grab a drink of water, have a snack, or use the bathroom. Don't worry, there will be bathrooms on the other floors at the museum, too. There are three floors at the museum. To see the exhibitions, you need to go up the escalators with your group leader. Don't forget your museum manners. Our friendly docents are easy to spot. Look for the folks wearing the red vests and museum name badges. They can point out cool things in the exhibitions that you might not notice on your own. You may also see the Natural History Gallery. In here, you will come face to face with a giant mammoth, explore climate change, see a tidal pool, and go under the sea in Ocean Station. On the third floor of the museum, you will find the Modern History Gallery, where you can look through the store windows in Old Town, try and strike it rich at the gold mine, and go aboard Captain George Vancouver's ship Discovery. In the First Peoples Gallery, you will share in the culture and traditions of the First Peoples, look into a pit house and stand amongst the big poles of the Totem Gallery. If your teacher or tour leader included a visit to IMAX, you'll want to hold on to your seat. We hope you have a fun time visiting the Royal BC Museum.